Sir Simon Fraser of Oliver and Neot Puff, Knight Banneret fought in the Wars of Scottish Independence. Early life, Simon Fraser was born in P. Blesher, where the clan Fraser was dominant and held power as the Lords of Oliver Castle. Wars of Independence, for a time he fought alongside Andrew Murray, and after that man's death, William Wallace. He led the Scottish victory at the Battle of Roslyn alongside John III Cummin, Lord of Badenoch. Consequently the English king, Edward I, marched north through Stirling taking Perth. As Edward approached Dunfermline, the Bishop of St Andrews and the Bishop of Glasgow along with Red Cummin met his army and submitted. Simon refused to swear fealty to the English king and did not attend. This defiance would later lead to his execution. In 1304, Fraser fought with William Wallace at Hapru and was defeated. Later Fraser fought for King Robert I of Scotland. He escaped from the king's defeat at the Battle of Mpfen, but was captured in 1306 at a subsequent engagement at Kirkencliff near Stirling by Sir Thomas de Milton and Sir John Jose. Fraser was sent to London, and hanged, drawn and quartered in September 1306. His head was impaled on a spike on London Bridge, as were those of his brother, John Fraser, and William Wallace. Lands, Sir Simon Fraser of Oliver acquired the Bissett lands around Bowley when he won the hand of its heiress, a young Bissett. King Alexander III granted the right of the Lordship of Leveth, Bulgomarich, in the Aird, in 1253, and the corresponding lands, to Simon Fraser of Lovat either his son or cousin, from whom the clan Fraser claims descent. Sir Simon held other lands in Kincardineshire, which were given to his eldest son, Sir Alexander Fraser of Cowie. It is from Alexander that the Frasers of Falorth descend. The next century in 1336, Thomas Fraser of the Frasers of Muchhalls, gained the estates of Stonywood and Muchhalls in Kincardineshire, and soon erected a Tauhaus stronghold overlooking the North Sea. It is not clear whether this tower house was an expansion of an earlier structure on the site. This tower house was further greatly expanded in the early 17th century, and became known as Much Hall's Castle. See also, Fetteresso Castle. Notes and references. Bibliography, http, www.scottish-history.com slash. Farkirk3.shtml. Baronage Press on Simon's Family